We've heard a lot of stories in recent days about ordinary people thrust into extraordinary circumstances. Brian Moore is here with the story of one such survivor who was there when the plane crashed into the Pentagon. Lucky guy. Very much so. Lloyd England is a cab driver, Wendy, and he was on his way to pick up his last fare on Tuesday morning when he decided to take a different route to avoid a traffic jam. It's a route that put him right in front of the Pentagon. It, it happened out at one time. Lloyd England has seen lots of adventures in Capital Cab 677, but nothing like the sheer terror Tuesday morning as he was driving along Washington Boulevard when American Airlines Flight 77 thundered over his head, picking up a utility pole and hurling it like a javelin into the front seat of his car before crashing into the Pentagon. I couldn't follow the plane. All I could do was look up and see the plane and deal with the pole. That was it. When I got a chance to look for the plane, there was no plane. And I looked at the Pentagon and I wondered where did the plane go? There was no trace of a plane. It was all inside the building. There was no tail section laying on the side. There were no wheels laying out on the ground. It had disappeared. England escaped with only scratches to his hands and some back pain. Uh, this tore the dash right out of it, tore the seat off. Anybody on the right hand side with a purse. And the car wouldn't start. When I tried to start the car, the car would not start. Did you expect it to? Yeah, I, I was going to leave. I wasn't going to leave my car sitting in the middle of, of Washington Boulevard. So England was forced to abandon his beloved cab and walk home amid reports that another suicide plane might be incoming. He made friends with a soldier, and as they were walking, they found a dollar bill on the road. The soldier tore it in half. He signed one part of the dollar bill. I signed the other part of the dollar bill. And he gave me the side of the dollar bill that he signed. And uh, I'm going to keep this. It might not mean anything to anyone else, but as long as I'm alive, it means something to me. As for why he survived when so many others perished, England doesn't have a good answer. But he and his family are grateful. I don't try to explain what I don't know how to explain. I don't know how to explain it. Only thing I know is that I'm still here. For what reason, I can't not tell you. I don't know. Well, Lloyd is out of work for the time being because his cab is out of commission, obviously, and he says he's going to get a new one, and he says that that one, too, will be his lucky number, cab number 677. He should stick with that. It worked for him. Thank you, Brian.